After a morning in Stornoway, it's time to continue our Atlantic crossing with our next stop of the Faroe Islands, just off the coast of Scotland. The islands get less than 900 hours of sunshine each year, making them the least sunniest place in the world. With winter bringing in strong winds from the north, we can expect some rough weather the closer we get to the islands. During this stage in the ferry fight, we would want to consider multiple things. Uh, survival dry suit, life raft, portable marine radio, emergency beacon, uh, among other things. There's plenty of articles online uh, you can look up to help uh, prepare for the trip. With all of our permits received, though, uh, as much fuel as we can put on the plane, it's time to start the second leg of our trip. Once we are ready to go, we will be taxiing out to runway 36 for departure, which works perfectly for us since we'll be straight out departure to the north. There won't be much of uh, any weather, surprisingly, as we depart in Stornoway and continue our track north. The weather forecast, however, for our time of arrival, unfortunately, won't look quite as good, but we can talk about that further on. Once we get airborne, we'll go in a bit more in-depth on today's route and why it takes just a little bit more more preparation. thing to note is that we will be transitioning into flying in class 2 airspace. This is defined as any in-route flight operation that is not entirely within operational service volumes of an ICAO standard NAVAID. Those NAVAIDs include VOR, VOR, DMEs, and NDBs. Any in-route flight operation that is not entirely within these operational service volumes or the area which these ground-based navigation aids can reliably send a signal uh, that is considered class 2 airspace. Also there is a requirement to at least once an hour reliably fix your position using these ground-based nav aids. Seeing as we'll not be able to do either of those two, we'll be flying by dead reckoning. Let's take a look at the two nav aids we have available. One is the Stornoway VOR, which is a high altitude VOR capable of transmitting a reliable signal up to 40 nautical miles up to an altitude of 14,500 feet. However, since we are planned to fly at flight level 180, this increases the reliable signal range to 100 nautical miles. Still, however, short of our 233 nautical mile trip. The other nav aid, which I dare not pronounce as to summon something in my room, is up near Vowar, our arrival airport. The Mike Yankee NDV has a reliable range of 50 nautical miles, which means we'll have uh, about an 83 nautical mile section where we'll have to fly via dead reckoning. The current weather in Voar have winds from the north at 17 knots. There is a gust factor down low as well. Good visibility with a ceiling of around 1,000 feet with light freezing drizzle in the vicinity. We can expect a pretty rough approach with frequent wind shifts uh, on the arrival. If anyone is interested, the Voar airport has special tables specifically designed around the unique winds here. And 
here we are, turning on to the localizer now. We can see the autopilot and myself are having a tough time keeping up with this, so I ended up disengaging the autopilot and flew the localizer approach manually. You'll see my speed tape changing pretty rapidly, with the vector going up and down rather sporadically as well. On this arrival specifically, in connection with the strong winds localized in this area, strong whirlwinds, or whirls as the approach tables uh, say, may create severe turbulence on short final, and I did my best to replicate this. And here we are in Voar, in the Faroe Islands, our second stop of many on our ferry flight across the Atlantic. I do hope you were able to learn a little bit about this special airport, as we only touched upon a small part of the many procedures this airport has. Our next leg will take us to Iceland, followed thereafter by Greenland. I'll do my best to keep this on a similar, regular upload schedule, but until next time, thanks for joining me, and Happy New Year's.